Thank you all for joining the workshop. This is alignment workshop and we are at day five. Thank you for your presence and doing the activities and completing the workshop with me and with everyone. So till now we have done the self alignment day one where we try to find out how my emotions, my feelings, my physical presence or existence and my uh, mental brain how it plays the games and how my spiritualism helps so four parameters we have discussed on d1 for the self alignment and we try to find the alignment not only in the affirmation with the help of the gratitude at the same time we introspect and find the gaps where we can do betterment either like if we are not doing the meditation we are started we have started the meditation maybe if we are not doing the physical exercise we have started that or if we have not um, watching our thoughts so we just kept ourselves aligned our thoughts with positive energy and day two we have discussed about how we can take our family alignment by giving our alignment to them to make them on our side it's a beautiful you know if you will see it's a beautiful game and it's it's a giving and coming back whatever you want in your life you have to give first if you are looking a love from someone you have to love someone first so when you will love someone without any selfishness unconditional love so then you will receive the love in back in abundance so if you are investing one you know one cent or one penny of love today universe is so kind and so compassionate and so merciful it will give you millions or billions love moments back to you for your lifetime which are good for the lifetime but you have to take that initiation initiative will be done at your side if you are looking the family alignment first make yourself align with the family talk to them connect with them appreciate them you know forgive them have patience keep listening them try to understand them so many things we have discussed for the day 2 alignment day 3 we discuss about the work alignment how the new things we should learn to make the things align with us today if we are aligning ourselves with the process technology and people tomorrow we will receive the output what we desire what we looking forward so day 4 we have discussed about all the assets prosperity all the relationship extended relationship like the neighbors or the extended family or you can say that uh, your home and your luxury and prosperity whatever you have created you are giving the alignment your alignment for those things so that you get your alignment with them they will give you they will support you they will be aligned with you with your all thought process so this day 4 we have done and day 5 is most 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 important day and i'm so happy this day is you know came today when already navratra has been started we have day 1 navratri and we started the navratri workshop also which is only like we have the recorded sessions but we can listen those and enjoy the blessings of ma durga so we just started that group uh, by uh, chance it is overlapping with today's uh, ending workshop however we don't want to miss that because that positive energy serves us for 6 months in october november when we got the another navratri cycle we are so fortunate to get the blessings like the two time in the year in the fullest way from our ma durga so we don't want to miss that so that's the reason we have started that parallel workshop so uh, it's pretty beautiful day today because the new energy creation has started today with the power of the ma durga 
and the with the blessings of the ma durga so today is the connect with universe so our alignment with our universe and universe we sometimes we cannot see universe how we will find like you know to whom i should align can i see that like to whom i am talking about so the nature and all the people no when i am saying i am aligned with everyone on this earth or all the people are aligned with me with my happiness so that is my connect with the universe one way of thinking another is when you are doing the meditation you are connecting your soul connect with the universe that is the universe connection and the third is the beautiful witness of universe is the nature if you will see the rivers lakes you know if you will see the air if you will see the trees if you will see the fruits on the trees you will find that they all are looking the alignment from your side if you are aligned with them they will be aligned with you so what we can do we can you know uh, give uh, some water to our plants today we can put some seeds for the new plants we can admire the nature so that is the one my alignment with the universe so that nature keep its alignment with me for my beautiful life so that will help you so this is the another area and the another important area is five elements of nature which makes me complete from where i came and for from or which place i am going back that is the five elements air which i am utilizing for taking the breath in and the breath out so that is my air alignment if i am getting the proper oxygen to survive on the earth till my lifetime that is the my air alignment i am getting the good air you know at the same time the water my body has 80% water and that water should be transparent clean and positive and giving the positive energy to me you know that water connect with my body with myself with my thoughts so think about that like uh, water has a memory so whatever you are thinking water is keeping that memory and your body already have 80% water whatever you are drinking our blood is made up of 80% water that much our thoughts which are circulating in that blood or that water that is making our personality that is making our thoughts so our our feelings our thoughts if they are positive if they are you know uh, you know uh, generating the positive vibrations so the water in my body my blood will be pure and slowly slowly by default healing will start automatically this is the another witness or evidence of the nature like our water can heal us our thoughts can heal us if you are thinking i am grateful for my perfect health irrespective of maybe some portion of your body is paining right now but still if you have that faith my i am in a perfect health so slowly slowly your emotions your thoughts your body listens and change the vibration as your vibration will change your thoughts your feeling your emotion will change in your body the water purify the blood purify in your body and it will start healing so always remember water is a beautiful gift given by the universe so whenever you are drinking the water just bless the water and then drink it feel that this is a you know divine water i am drinking for myself for my goodness so that is the uh, water alignment then come to the sky if you are doing a daily walk or you are spending some time in a uh, open sky just keep your both the hands up 
towards the sky and make them open uh, widely and take a deep breath inhale and exhale and say thank you universe for all the divine blessings in my life so you will see like you will feel so happy in that quick one moment when you will do this exercise automatically your vibration is going to change so this is the sky is just like a father it's just like a a shield or you can see the umbrella over us from where the sky is coming we don't know because this is infinite this is the again the witness of universe presence we are coming and going from this world but the sky is standing same for every birth so we should be grateful for that alignment and keep this exercise today or when you get the little time go in the nature take a deep breath inhale and exhale and open your arms widely towards the sky and say thank you universe for all the blessings you are sending me this is the sky alignment now come to the earth earth is just like a mother figure people used to say in spiritualism earth is mother as mother is so patient full as mother is so forgiving as mother is so loving and compassionate same is the earth we are standing over it we are rolling over it we are doing so many things and we are getting so many blessings farmers are raising the crops fertilizers so many food we are getting from this earth mother earth we are getting the diamonds and the jewels and the you know so many things we are getting from this mother earth and she is so forgiving we are doing something not good on this earth still we are not getting the punishment she is forgiving us with compassion heart so we should be you know thankful to the mother earth and ask for the forgiveness like a ho puno puno and feel loving as as your mother so that will make you more connected with your roots because earth is our roots and only the earth you know that planet has a surface mars or moon we are exploring because there is a surface surface to stand jupiter is the biggest planet but we don't have the surface there to stand so we are so fortunate we are rotating mother earth is rotating all the time around the sun but still we are getting that much of stable factor to stand properly on this surface so we should be grateful to this blessing also so earth is a really divine blessing for giving us so many uh, fruits and uh, giving us uh, making us grow and we can do so many beautiful things and create so many things earth is giving the alignment to us to make us grow to live our beautiful life so that is the fifth alignment or the fifth evidence of the universe so these are the things like we can do today and at the same time today's alignment day is for future also the future things which are unopened for us we can give the gratitude and ask for the perfect alignment for my beautiful future future is coming for my beautiful life so whatever dream whatever desire whatever you know wish you have that is going to be connect with your future and that alignment is very much required and the beauty of that alignment is if you have the alignment with yourself with your emotions with your spiritualism if you have the alignment with your family if you have the alignment with your work if you have the alignment with your asset and the extended relations if you have the alignment with the universe with five elements with the nature you will get the by default alignment from the future if anybody is the science 
graduate they know that like there is a theorems in our graduation or in our science how or in the maths how we used to prove this is true for one this is true for n definitely this will be true for n plus one hence proved every theorem ends with that hypothesis like if it is true for n one it is true for n definitely it will be true for n plus one so similar way if you are aligned with your past if you are aligned with your present all the things which we have are discussing from the last four days if you have that alignment definitely you will get the alignment with your future because the same thing you are going to get in n plus one the same kind of the people same kind of the prosperity same kind of the health which you are vibrating today that will be the your better or you can say the you know previous day uh better you are getting to make a new dough that way like as we are doing for the yogurt or dosa better so similar way we are going to utilize that positive energy from our past and present to generate our future and definitely our future will be brighter than the past and present because we are pulling the positive energy from our past pulling the positive energy from our present to generate our future so law of attraction and law of karma all the time is working so whatever you are going to see today you are getting that uh, field to grow and the beauty of today's day is already the creation has been started because the navratri has started today so today is really blessed day let me brief the today's activities what we have to do uh, we have to be grateful for all the five elements to being aligned i am grateful for my alignment with earth air water sky and fire fire elements which make us make us grow make us take a burning desire to reach its goal our our body is using that fire factor so fire alignment is very much required so that also need to be added without fire we cannot cook the food we cannot be healthy we cannot survive fire in our body is making us to take the further actions in our life you know so that alignment is also required so that we will write in a gratitude today we will do the meditation today without fail because that is another alignment with the universe and we can admire the nature or we can give the gratitude to the beautiful nature at the same time we have to give the gratitude to our future alignment with my beautiful life which i am looking for okay so that way we have covered today's day and we will share the thank you moment of the day for sure so uh, at the same time we will accumulate all the knowledge which we have gathered from day 1 day 2 3 3 day 4 day 5 so we will be aligned uh, with myself we will be aligned with family with work with all the prosperity assets perfect health and universe and always remember we can write the health gratitude also today because the health is a very good blessing which is coming from the universe and with our conscious efforts it's not only universe is giving us the health or it is not only our efforts but our efforts can improve the health our consciousness can improve the health but still the consent stand with universe so we are grateful to the universe for perfect health so keep us vibrating on the positive energy you know sometimes we feel like the consciousness or wisdom or awareness also comes with the universe blessing if universe is not blessing us we are not doing this workshop you know so at the first place universe blessing is there then all our souls like which should do this workshop you know because there is no recording i am sorry for that i thought like i will keep that but the day one there uh, i was not able to complete that recording so i i have all the recordings but i have not created the youtube link it will be better next time so 
but at the same time you know the people who are joining today or the like five days they are really have the universe blessing and this is i am not doing anything you will be very surprised i am not reading anything from anywhere this is all the universe blessings coming for you guys i am just an instrument i am just a medium which sharing these wisdom with you guys this is for you this is the blessing for you and me also because with your presence i am also blessed of doing this workshop i am also writing my activities i am also creating that i am also uh, take getting the blessings from all of you guys when you are writing uh, in the chats so it's a win win condition and definitely we should be grateful to the universe like we are vibrating on the positive energy this is all about from my side today thank you everyone for joining today's session and big 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 thank you for joining this workshop making the time aligned from the different time zones making your presence available here to complete this workshop and uh, thank you to vanna ji for being with me as an admin without her i cannot run the show and thank you to all the core members because if nobody is there they are there i am so happy for their presence because their intense energy is making me to create the more wisdom sessions thank you and thank you to the newcomers for all the faith and trust in our wisdom and joining this community with us i am so happy and so thankful to everyone so god bless all of us with the bundles of love peace prosperity perfect health happiness happy and loving family together now thank you thank you thank you so be it so be it so be it if you have any sharing any question you can ask me now